any moment now. Any moment now. Literally now. In a bit. Possibly like coming up very soon. So I've got a text from right Matt, our old housemate, who's doing it in London. Uh -huh. He just sent me a text saying systems go, so I presume they've got their text. Right. Ross, get your ass in it. Oh, this is Tom, everybody. Keith Cott. Hello. Nice to meet you, John. Keith Cott. Keith gets, gets both names. Because <laughs> you're trying to market yourself. There you go. <laughs> When? Oh, oh, Chris. oh. Thank you. we got the text, everybody. Ooh. It's beginning. Let's gather. It begins. Okay. Hush, I'm all, I'm all in silence, please. Okay. Uh, ooh, I don't know how to work your phone, mate. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay, cool, right. The title is called Stopped Motion. Uh, the line is, we use smart water. It's very effective. The prop is fake ID. Got some fake ID. Um, <laughs> what? <laughs> we see a character um, tampering with a small credit card size ID badge with a photo on it. They put their own current photo on it, making it false ID or an update. Optional: a virus that kills language. Okay. Wow. <laughs> when did you buy this paper? I, I someone's going to throw it out, and I was like, I really will need that one day, and it will happen. <laughs> so stop motion. So the the idea that he's like just unaware uh, or not unaware, but just kind of going wrong as a robot, rather mm -hmm. than him being in, intently trying to sabotage. <laughs> Okay, so, John, do you want to explain what we got so far? <laughs> <laughs> probably a good recap moment. Okay, right, okay. Um, it's a robot that is designed to be a weapon. Uh, it destroys language. Um, he's on the run from people that are trying to track him down because he's managed to get free of the lab in which he was created and whatever. Do you know what you are? A slave. A weapon. Uh, the, the, there's going to be points in the film where he's trying to check his, uh, his status on the computers, and this mm. is when we can show, like... Facebook. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> this is when he destroys <laughs> coding language and computer language and all this kind okay. of thing. And then I'm guessing we need to have, we haven't really figured out like what happens then, like how the film ends really. Well we could, we, we could create something like, if we used like, the tower idea as like a symbol for Babel or whatever. Um, he could be, he could be, I don't know, he could be trying to get to the, the tower or something of the tower either makes or breaks it, is it, gives it a natural conclusion. This no, is a SA-80. It's an assault it? weapon. <laughs> um, the SA-80 is quite an awkward rifle. So it's not what I was sort of trained on, but... So you um, pull down the um, mag release there. And pop it back in. Talking about how to kill men. <laughs> and then so if I was going to kill Ross... Keep on keep on making it so stop killing. Oh, man. You never know when you're going to need an axe. So, there it is. And we've got something here. Is this a reflector? A water reflector. Uh, the final stage to me being a filmmaker is only a reflector. Now I own one. Fantastic. Um, some, some of this, which is just policy. Uh, possibly to create a, a really off the cuff rig to protect the camera um, from rain. rain that is probably going to hit us. Uh, got a plan for every event, right? You do. So that's why we have an axe. Yes, you do. Yeah, what are we um, going to try and find? At the moment, we're on the, we're on the hunt for um, the long lost, abominable Bristol Snowman. No. Bristol Communications Snowman. Tower.
Robot Pursued, take two. Action. A little bit, a little bit weirded out, but here we, are, out. here we are carrying sort of quite large, quite realistic looking guns yeah, in this battle lane. At the moment, it's, I, I'm not in this scene, um, but when it comes to the point when I'm having one of these rifles and pistols pointed at me, it's yeah. a bit of a different story. Um, it does happen, right? Doesn't it, scriptwriter? What's that? I get a gun pointed at me at some point? Right at the very end. There you go, yeah. so it does happen, so I'm not looking forward to that. I've never had a gun pointed at me before. Motion. <laughs> Killed in action. KIA. Cyborg dead. <laughs> Snake. No, that's wrong, isn't it? <laughs> that's me. <laughs> Wait. Colonel, what's ID doing here? <laughs> so, so, uh, I, 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 ideally, you walk into shot. Mm -hmm. um, so, you walk into shot, stop, again, beat. Beat. So, um, maybe. Floor, so we're all standing round the body of our fallen comrade watching, here. Uh, watching Chris get bloodied up. It's looking good. Oh, it. Why am I still holding that one? Sorry. Relax. Yeah, no, but I'm annoying myself. <laughs> <laughs> no one else is There's annoying no me. Or anything. <laughs> <laughs> you have to stop the Let's go. <laughs> 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 It's an intense scene, but I had so many Betty Art. It's ridiculous. It's art. It's me, me, me. The camera is rolling. Let's go, let's do it. I want to live. That is my decision to make, surely. Sir, sir, he's tapped into the system. I, I don't know, he, uh, our language is supposed to be impenetrable, but he's, he's uploading himself. Oh, sir, sir! <laughs> <laughs> what you need is one of those, yeah, one of those, like, put your shoes on your knees and run in. <laughs> sir, he's uploading himself. So I was, um, I guess I was probably with you, or we last left you with this, um, I'd say about 4 p.m. yesterday. Um, so how so how much sort of progress has been made sort of since yes the end of um, the day of yesterday's shooting? Well, I guess after that we we did the last little bits ran around drove around. Yeah, like, I mean like we still people. we still had like half the footage to shoot at that point, yeah. which we did. We drove and around and did like little bits everywhere. Yeah, sort of last little bits of light, You're losing light like crazy. Um, we had we to drop like, one scene. We we're going to do it at the train tracks. Yeah. We rewrote the film. Yeah. <laughs> you rewrote the film. To do it. Fly, yeah. <laughs> Sturdy money. Um, yeah, and then so we we did the last little bits while there was light. We got the last little bits of location, like outside location. Things. Yeah. And then we stocked up on food and snacks. And that was quite possibly the best. A solid five-hour session of shooting the conference. We had an intense. It was minimum five hours. It was yeah. five hours of you guys shooting and me dumping and sinking everything we'd done previously. Yeah, it was absolutely intense. And what was amazing, the location, we didn't have any time limits, so we could just stay there all night. Uh, the only time that we had was Simon, our cameraman, had to leave with the camera. Oh, no. Was really critical. Too soon. Um, very, uh, very early to, to do another shoot, an all-day shoot at Silverstone today. I think, I think. Um, okay, I think I've, um, I've distracted you enough from okay. your work over here, so I'll, I will let you get back to it. Thank you. Excellent. I want to do some refining. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, okay, so that. Well, we're come to the final few hours, and I'm just going up to see what Chris and the boys are, how they're doing. Let's see what's going on. Hey, man. Hello, everybody. Hey. And how was last night? It's still going on. <laughs> yeah, no, <laughs> last, last night never ended. We're still in. We're still in last night. <laughs> Matt is absolutely dead. <laughs> I've never seen him like this. He's got no energy. He's completely drained. Is he going to have anything left for tonight? Do you think, or? It's going to be. It's going to be interesting to find out. It is.
What time is it? It's 5 to 11. Is it? We've got two hours when we get to uh, the post office. I think we're there, but if we, if we, if we get I've got a car. Laxed, then what? if we get laxed, then we're going to lose our We can take my car to the post office. Where we, what? Burn to a DVD. Once a DVD is burning and this is uploading to the post office, back here to make sure it's uploaded on time, and then we've got the PR, we've got the, um, we've got the circus, We've got to like go Broadway. We've oh, got to Chris go. Yeah. I should be serious then, Chris. God, <laughs> it's too. I'm too sleep deprived to take the sarcasm right now. <laughs> Please don't sack me. Please work with me again. God damn it! A game. A game of chance. I was playing a game of survival. Well, I, we've come, as far as I can tell, to the end. File is currently uploading there. Um, Chris's feet have just gone onto the desk. Um, Ross is watching the final cut. Um, Matten is looking asleep. Um, thank you, Ross. So, gentlemen, how has it been? Been, well, I've, I've hit the wall for the first time in this weekend. It kind of shows you that I've been doing these things too many times. But, uh, because around the, because around the 48 hour mark, you crash out. I look for some really nice, look forward to some really nice food. Mm. Really nice food. Except food. What are you thinking of having? Fry up sounds absolutely amazing. Crab somewhere? I don't know. Spoons? Uh, what the spoons? Yeah. Experience, experience of the weekend. What is everybody's best and worst experience of the weekend? Could be anything. I think the best experience for me was when we had to do the balls to the walls edit where we cut two minutes out. Ah, uh, right. <laughs> that was the amazing. Yeah. Bit. <laughs> yeah. The first cut was seven minutes long, and we had a five-minute limit. Yeah, I think I was there when you were doing that. Yeah. Uh, so we had to cut two minutes. We managed to do it without cutting any single scene. So we kept everything intact, we just made it super punchy. Um, it's literally edited down to the second. We've got five minutes, it finishes on five. Fantastic. So, uh, How are you feeling about it, Chris? Um, what, my best bit and the worst best bit? bit. Best, best bit. Um, I think the best bit was um, pitting the sound together at the very end when it was all coming together. We had the music, we had the sound, we had the grade, and it just yes. all came together. I also really enjoyed pitting the balls to walls edit <laughs> yeah. It was quite fun, but also quite sadistic at the same yeah. time. Sadistic. As we spent hours going it one way, and then we had to go right, get rid of it. And it's quite weird how just the story just emerges through the edits and stuff. Yeah. And my worst part was probably about two o'clock, three o'clock this morning when I was doing the special effects, and it was not going my way at all. And I could have just had a little cry then. That would have been nice. But I don't want to be very manly at all. I was going to say, but and did you? No. <laughs> what about you, Matt? What was your best and worst um, bit? Best bit has got to be just the. The end product, man. I mean, wow. Like, <laughs> wow. I mean, like, you, you'll, you'll get to see it, John, of course. Yeah, it has to be really good because John had done it Exactly, yeah. exactly. So you are in for a treat. Like, the, the amount of ground that we've covered in only 48 hours, and so it's documented, we did it all from scratch. There was no pre prep to this, we didn't sort of yeah. preempt anything. It was just got the text, this, 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 bang, 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 story done, shoot, edit. And it's done, and the end product is just. I think I would say it's beyond any of our initial expectations. I think it way beyond. Definitely is definitely. way beyond. And it's really good. It's really it's, good. No, but it is. It's so emotive. Like it's so gripping. Wow. I can't wait to see it. Yeah. Yeah. It's all right. <laughs>